Just a disclaimer, Channel 4 are cunts and claimed my video and blocked it from anyone trying to watch it in the UK. So in an attempt to avoid this punishment, um, uh, some bits of the video might look distorted or zoomed in or high pitched. That's just an attempt to kind of dodge the copyright bullshit that Channel 4. I tried to claim, I tried to um, dispute the claim. They were having none of it. They're cunts. So fuck Channel 4. Hopefully you can still enjoy the video regardless. But yeah, that's just a quick explanation of why some of the bits of the video will look weird. This might be my favourite channel on YouTube. The binge watching potential of this channel, ladies and gentlemen, is truly extraordinary. And, better yet, if I do another one of these videos, I will wear a chef's hat. So try your best to enjoy this video and share it with your friends. Because although maybe me wearing a chef's hat in a video is not going to be as funny as I think it's going to be, I just want an excuse to buy a chef's hat. We're going to be looking at Gordon Ramsay going to prison, first of all. I've already seen this this first thing, he goes to prison for the first time, I've, I've seen that. I wanted to check out this one because this convict cooks scrambled eggs for Gordon Ramsay. Does anyone else see a batarang there? But yeah, I want to see I want to see how this goes, because as a, as a bit of a, a scrambled egg connoisseur myself, I must admit, I should be able to weigh in here pretty well. Let's turn on ad block as well, let's not forget that. If my videos aren't getting ads, I'm not going to advertise other people's ads, you know? Not that that makes them any more money, but it just, you know, hurts my own um, pride and bank account. Um, so so yeah, let's watch Scrambled Eggs. Morning guys. Why am I here? First off, what is it with Gordon Ramsay videos? The quality says 1080p. Gordon Ramsay videos are always like in 360p. All of them. Maybe it's because they were made, like it's uploaded now, but I think this probably was filmed like six years ago. I've never seen Gordon Ramsay in HD, I don't think. I've never seen him in high enough definition to see the wrinkles of stress and anger on his face, you know? Also, crackhead. Also, smug. Also, is he wearing fur? What the fuck? How's he gotten that? <laughs> They're all dressed in like normal, just like shirts and shit. This guy's wearing fucking Gucci. Give you guys a chance to earn and learn and put back inside. This looks like like a middle-aged Kendrick Lamar cooking scrambled eggs for Gordon. I'm sorry, is that racist? Maybe I should cut that. Is that racist? That might- okay, that might be racist actually. But low-key, do you not see what I mean? <laughs> sorry, I didn't mean it in a racist way. They just look similar. I'm sorry. What made you want to get involved with this? It's a good question, really. This guy's a question asker. This guy- this guy could cause trouble. He's got a bit of an attitude. He's not afraid to speak. You can always tell someone's got a bit of an attitude, a bit of self-confidence when they're- uh, when they feel so confident shouting out in the class, you know? This guy's one of those kids. Although they're prisoners. This, is, this isn't a classroom. I'm not- I'm gonna describe them as a classroom from now on. Like, Gordon's the- like, the substitute teacher, and these are all just school children. That's how I'm gonna look at this for a bit. My little brother became a heroin addict, and my father became an alcoholic. Do I sit there? And join my little brother? No. I got off my ass. I stopped for feeling sorry for myself, put my head down, learnt a craft, and that's the journey I'm hoping that we're gonna go on. That's good advice to give to the class, I'm not gonna lie. I have less than six months to kick this motley crew into shit. <laughs> hang on, hang on. My man is wearing a Luigi hat without the logo. Is my man a big Nintendo fan? And maybe the guards thought that the Luigi, like the L on, on the Luigi hat was some sort of gang sign. So they just ripped it off. So now he's just left with this, this nice green hat, potentially. Wait, hang on. Oh shit, where is it? Yeah, here. Wait, is it? See, it's got a bit of like the, 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 you know, the poofiness to it. This could be a chef's hat. All right. All right, so this is my new chef. This is my chef's hat until I get the real thing. And me and my guy, we know what's up. Have a seat, fellas. Just chill out for a moment, okay? Is that Greg Wallace? Did he want to get on a better cooking show? But can any of them even cook a simple dish of scrambled eggs? It's, what do you mean That's simple? You it's a complex dish, Gordon. Shut up. Do you know how much, you know, love, care, practice, determination, and accuracy needs to go in to making scrambled egg. It's not all that, you know. It's not. Well, no, it is all that. Fucking hell. It's not all that. L. You know what that stands for? Love. And that's the most important ingredient. I couldn't think of anything better that started with the letter L. I'm not gonna lie. Anthony, hi. Little task. Little plate. I did not just spill my drink. Dude, it's this hat. This hat is so tight. There's no blood or oxygen getting to my head right now, and my body's starting to malfunction already. A burglar. Anthony Kelly. Is this like... This looks like- hang on, this place is not only a presentation room, a briefing room, it's also a kitchen, a chapel, it's also a cinema, there's also a waiting room. Dude, do they just have one room in this prison and then just cells everywhere? Is that all they have? I'm not proud of what I've done, I'm ashamed of what I've done. Jan, just tapped and died, I've done my life. I've been doing cocaine 10 years of age, I could give. 10 years old, he's on cocaine! Holy shit! I thought Roach Shaw was taken from us at a young age. This is new levels. 10! Fuck. When was the last time you made a comedy? Um, at home with my old woman. Nice. Um, yeah. I hope you're, you're getting romantic now. 
Yeah. <laughs> 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 reckon he just put like a like a, a bug or something on on Gordon's. You know, he put like a microphone or something or like a, some kind of tracking device to like. And I'm not gonna lie, Anthony doesn't look like that much of a high tech burglar. But you know what? Looks can be deceiving. Maybe he's playing a character right now. He just stuck something on Gordon's. Thing, which is gonna help him escape. Maybe Gordon's in on it. Holy shit, maybe Gordon's in on it. He feels bad for him. This whole thing is Gordon behind bars is to get these guys out of the bars and get them into his bars to work at his restaurant. See, big old conspiracy and I'm just uncovering it right now. Right, little taste. I fucking filth in it. Disgusting in it. <laughs> Fucking filth. Yeah, first off, that that's an omelet. <laughs> just the way right, he was so he he knew before you could tell he knew before he tried it how it, this was gonna taste. <laughs> Fucking filth, <laughs> mate. <laughs> Fucking filth. You know, what some people call crime, we call the way of life. I don't really know, you know, criminal terminology or lingo or whatever, but um. What is the difference between like bodily harm and actual bodily harm? Like, what what role does the actual play in in that term? My first my first thing was uh, robbing post offices. Robbing post offices because you know your your granny's postcards are incredibly valuable on the black market. The the kiss stamp that she does, you know, the the cute little handwriting she, you know, in the criminal underground, it's invaluable. My first my first thing was uh, robbing post offices. This time it's assault that I'm in for. See, that's that's quite that's quite a jump he's made, isn't it? It's quite a jump. Robbing someone's Amazon package to attacking someone. Sounds like having your first beer to like pumping liters of vodka in your veins, you know, beating someone. Pretty bad. Murder would be like just pumping like petrol straight into your veins, you know? Quite a big jump from that first beer you had. It's becoming apparent that I'm starting at rock bottom here. We got a leak in the ceiling. Look, there's the batarang. There's the, you see it. There's like the wings, and then there's like the set. It's definitely there. You know, it obviously doesn't look like a batarang. It looks like fucking just mush, with like liquid pouring out of it. Yeah, that's not okay. I'm no connoisseur of, of cooking, but when your scrambled eggs are running like that, probably not a good thing. They've probably not been done to perfection. You know, they've probably been not done enough. I hope I don't sound really snobby because I know literally nothing. My current like limit of my of my cooking is defrosting the loaf of bread in the freezer and probably making you know, scrambled egg on toast. Maybe I could learn some from these guys, to be fair. It's burnt. It's a little bit burnt. burnt. A little bit burnt. Yeah. Oh, yo, he's got like a hairnet in the back as well. She See that shit? Yo, I need one of them as well for videos because can't have hair getting on the lens. Bit burnt. Yeah. Either it was shit or he tasted the drugs that were being stashed in there. <laughs> Fuck, did he spit it out? That's a bit rude, you know? That's a bit rude. Can't be that bad. That water coming out the side, what do you think that means? It's wet. <laughs> it won't cook long enough. No, it's overcooked. It's overcooked Other way, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's overcooked. Oh. Dude, I was saying earlier when it's watery, it's not been done enough. That shows you how much I know. I'm literally stupid. I actually learned something. Holy shit. A disaster in the kitchen. Right, Gordon, we've uh, finished the episode. What kind of outro would you want for, for the uh, for the video? You heard of fucking ASMR? Fucking ASMR. Fucking speak ASMR, boys. Get it done. That's another place you can learn um cooking, by the way, you know? Harry Rotashaw makes a lovely creme brulee. He really does. Right, so that was like fucking 10, 15 minutes of a five minute video about how to cook scrambled eggs for, for prisoners. If you learned something, like me, leave it in the comments. What did you learn from this video? I learned that overcooking scrambled eggs makes them watery and undercooking them doesn't. I genuinely didn't know that and I claim to be an expert. I don't deserve, I don't deserve to wear this hat. I'm a fraud, I don't, I don't deserve, deserve it. it. Don't look at my hair. Fuck. Yo, I should have been wearing it like this. This is a chef's hat. How does my hairline look right now? Probably shit. Oh, petitions get KSI to wear this. Fuck the bandana, JJ. Just wear- Why am I wearing these? Fuck the bandana, JJ. Just wear one of these things. Luigi chef's hat. Dude, it's so tight. Fuck, ow. Yo, I look fly. I'm looking fly. If I had this on for a whole recording, it would just leave a, like a band around my forehead. I'm creating a new hairline right here. Loser. Right, in the comments, uh, petition to get me a sh real chef's hat or to just use this one. Actually, leave a vote. Should I use this or should I get a proper chef's hat for the next video if there is an next re reacting to Gordon Ramsay uh, episode? And um, yeah, let me know if you want to see more videos like this. So yeah, thank you for watching everyone. Take care. Bye bye for now.